Slack attack. Oh yeah, the name is Slack. Thanks for coming back. Let's walk through some more Skyrim Pure Thief Field. Let's stick on the City of Influence quest Silver Lining for Mark Karth. Uh, for this, you would probably do well to bring at least one invisibility potion and a lock picking potion, which I've been selling. <laughs> But I feel confident that um, I can get through without one. But you might want to bring one. The best one we can make um, is only 9%. Also, if you don't have an invisibility potion, you can use any of any two of the following ingredients. Chorus eggs, ice ray teeth, luna moth wing, nern root, I don't have any of those, and Vampire Dust. For example, let's try Chorus Eggs and Vampire Dust. There we go. Invisible for 19 seconds, and that'll do it, okay? So nobody should be without an invisibility potion. Lock picking potions can be made with any two of the following Falmer Ear, Nimir's Rots, Pine Thresh Eggs, or Spider Eggs. Once again, that's Falmer Ear. Do we have any of those? No, we used them up in power potions. How about uh, I know I've got some Nimir's Rot. Right there, let's take one of those. And Pine Thresh Eggs, I've been having you loot those specifically for this purpose. There's one right there. Alright. Yeah, only 9%, but it'll help out. Stack that on top of your Thieves Guild gloves, I believe there. And you're good to go. Okay, combat gear on. 57 damage, that's correct. Let's get busy. Alright, Mr. Map, where is Endon? Endon is way over in Mark Hearth. Let's go there now. And he is always in the inn. Come on in. The Silverblood Inn has plenty of strong During this quest. and clean rooms. And in my man. What ah uh. silver, like my father. And his father before him. That's nice. Delvin Mallory sent me. Oh, thank goodness. I wasn't sure where else to turn. You idiot. Can't okay, you just start from the beginning. What? Several months ago, I ordered a special silver mold uh -huh. from some artisans in Valenwood by way yeah. of a Khajiit caravan. Well, it never arrived. Later, I found Shouldn't out that it was robbed by a group of bandits led by someone named Regal Strongarm. Regal Strongarm. Okay, you should have FedExed it. But anyways, uh, why do you need the guild's help for that? Look, I talked to the Jarl, the steward, the house car, the everyone. They all told me their resources were spread too thin right now. Word on the street says that the Thieves' Guild is coming back into its own in Markarth. So I figured... The Jarl is refusing to dispatch Send a thief to steal back what was stolen. Exactly. Hmm. Look, this mold is irreplaceable. I'll pay you well for its return. And I can also prove to be quite a valuable ally to the Thieves' Guild. Oh, there's no time to lose, then. To the Batmobile. <laughs> yes, indeed. Sorry, the I only thing resist. I can tell you is that the mold was taken to the bandits' hideout, a small cottage called Pine Watch. Pine Watch, got it. I'm not sure how many men they have inside, but I trust that won't be an issue for you. Hell no. Good luck. Hell no. You have silver to bend. Okay, now one thing you can do, and I highly recommend, not now though, is steal, steal pickpocket Kira's key from him, but not now. Do that afterwards when Markarth has been declared a city of influence. And we can pickpocket with reckless abandon. And I'll show you at the end of the video or the beginning of the next video why um, you want to do that. Next, um, show us where Pine Watch is, Mr. Map. Pine Watch is right here. Okay. So, all we have to do is fast travel to the Guardian Stones and ride on around. Thief Stone. Yeah, I changed my mind. I've decided I want to level up, um, work on leveling up archery instead of uh, Illusion. Illusion is is chugging along fine. Okay, so do an about face. Right on down past the hunter's camp. 
Hi there, remember me? <laughs> and just go straight for the quest marker. And we'll find this little cottage called Pine Watch. Gotta watch out, there's bears around here. And wolves. But more importantly, bears. Okay, now one thing you can do is just go right around to the front door, get off here, and quickly lockpick your way in. Keep the wolves off my back, Trigger. Oh, boy. Okay. Shields up, Scotty. Muffle. Let's get some D-Tech life happening. One guy down there. We're gonna take care of him later. Steal a couple of key items. Gonna leave all this junk here. Don't worry about that. Maybe take his booze. some ingredients and that's it hold up here maybe there's some important ingredients in here juniper berries <laughs> what <laughs> juniper berries there I was so excited to see him Mr. Mumble well, took over okay um, this guy we're gonna eventually have to well you don't have to kill him but I'm gonna because we need his soul so here's the plan calm don't do that Soul trap. I don't think I got him. Need something? Never hold up here, hold up, calm down. Back up. Should be able to one shot him. And we got ourselves a grand soul. In our black star. Yeah, so don't waste that opportunity. And you get a bounty, but as you saw in the top left corner of the screen, he was the only witness. <laughs> So it doesn't matter. Once you eliminate the last witness, you're clear. Okay, I can't be bothered with all this jump loot. Um, I believe there's some salt pile here somewhere. Here. That's it. Okay, we're done. Whoop. A bit of jump change. And it's a backstory. Oh, they left Rigel Strongarm. Rigel Strongarm left him some wine. And push this secret button here. Opens that up. Grab this. Grab the wine, and we're in. Okay. Muffling it up here, boss. This place has uh, torches that can be removed. Strongly recommend you do that. Okay, and I'm gonna stash them on one of those dead bandits there um, afterwards. I'm not keeping them, okay? So nobody have a shit fit. Okay, we got one guy here. There should be one guy back there. Let's see if we can get them into a fight. One thing you can do is push this thing off here like that, okay? And this is our this is our standoff point. This is a perfect place to put these guys in fury. Because they seem to get really confused when you stand there and they can't find you. So here we go. And in this corner. A riled up bandit. Weighing in at 180 pounds. Carrying a shield. Some kind of sword. And it is on. Oh, we got the three way. <laughs> I 
I never thought that Mayhem Illusion would be so much, uh, so powerful. You know, when people think of Skyrim Illusion. Okay. To end this little game. This is... That's why I had to go here. Because then you could just quickly drop off. You won't leave Skyrim alive! Okay, calm down there. You look a little agitated. One guy there. Did he kill the other guy? Okay, that usually doesn't happen. Looks like he is all by his lonesome. Okay. Watch out for bear traps. <clears throat> Pardon me. Yeah, usually there's a guy here, so he got drawn into the fight too. So you can go through here to get to the upper level again. And if this guy's all by his lonesome, we're gonna do him in. Let's try to level up our tree a little bit. Huh. Dude, you wiped out everybody? Good on ya. Okay, you just stay there. <laughs> Okay, and here. There, now we got it. This place over here. Huh? And get some. Come back over here. Atta boy. <laughs> Get a better shot at you here. There we go. Huh. This is the little thing. Here I had it. There we go. Okay. Now, stashing torches. There, I did not loot them. I don't want to drop on the ground because sometimes they kind of light up the area anyways, even if, you know. Okay. Muffling it up here, boss. Detect life on. Next area should be three guys. One guy working at the grindstone. Best guy to put fury on this guy on the grindstone. Right there. As soon as they're all engaged, I'm going to show you a nice little hidey hole. Okay, they're all engaged. Go off to the left here. Look for that wooden crate right there. And you can get right in this little hidey hole right here. Oh, come on. This is just so bullshit. Like he knew the spell was coming, he dodged out of the way. Okay. Whoops, aim slack. There we go. <laughs> yeah, this is a perfect little hidey hole here. And. Oh, there's only two left already. Trying to lead him. Okay, I want to hit this guy. Gotcha. Okay.
<laughs> okay, everybody stay nice and mad. Now ain't this a surprise? <laughs> Uh, she's shooting arrows at you. Okay, she's almost done. Oops, I didn't mean to do that. Sorry, buddy. Go over there. Go over there. Atta boy. <laughs> Go over there. Uh, over there. Over there. Atta boy. Now, down on your knees, bitch. Well, just die. That's good enough. <laughs> Alright. I'll bring it up here, boss. The way to continue, if you just look on your map, it's through this passage here and then down that way. So through here. Now what you want to do, there's a bandit marauder at the end. He's like way above our pay rate. We can't even like cast regular illusion spells on him. We have to use dual casting. But um, make sure you're up on this ledge on the right side. Just shoot him anyways. This will distract him enough. Or her enough. And they'll go up there. Why? Had a girl. Let's go up there and they're sufficiently distracted. You can get into sneaky sneaky along here. Just let like that. And ha <laughs> ha! Okay, next area. Let's refresh Muffle. Get some detect life happening. See what the situation is. Oh yeah, these three guys playing cards. Okay. Well, whatever. <laughs> Anyways. Leisure time. You get to sneak I'm around. Just hug the left side all the way around. Watch out for bear traps, as he, they're talking about. Hug the left side. All the way around. Pretty sure I passed one earlier back there. Got by. Here's another one. Keep sticking to the left side. And you get up on this ledge here. Look for an opening on the left. And you're good. Another guy in here. This guy's all by his lonesome, so we can like use him to level up some archery. Lots of hiding places back here. Watch out for the trap. And let's kick things off. You know you're using iron arrows? Like, yep, I know I'm using iron arrows. I want to use them up. This is going to get the job done anyways. And we get tons of steel arrows. You might as well use these up. Save these for like higher level activities. And you can just tuck yourself in between these two cages here. I've never seen him come here. Of course, I just I I pressed the record thing. button, so all bits are off whenever that happens, as you any of your hardcore, hardcore slackers know. The recording handicap. I know I heard I guess I was just hearing <laughs> Can you hear me now? Hold up, hold up here. Hold up. He went in the cage? Wow, I've never seen him do that. Okay, it's just getting calm, ready. <laughs> Always a good idea. I wonder if he'll go back there again. Whoa, whoa. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 
Back up there, big boy. Okay. Okay, let's let him calm down a bit. Must be my imagination. Yeah, just your imagination. Let me just test to make sure Tom works on it. Yes, it does. Okay. Don't have to deal fast. Let's speed things up here a bit. <laughs> <laughs> Playing with a highwayman here, boss. Yeah, down your knees. And down you go. Okay. Job well done. Job well done. Next. This one is way above our pay grade. I believe this is a band of marauders, so our, our illusion spells won't work unless we dual cast them. Yeah, it's a marauder. Okay. So, calm up, dual casting, calm, and just sneak past. Pick up some steel if you want to fight me. What are you looking for? Follow around here. Should be one guy sleeping there. And four guys in the dining room. Forget about taking these guys on. This is what I had to bring the invisibility potion for. And I'll use the one that we, we created just to show you that it works. Okay. Make sure you cast Muffle before that. And you can sneak into Rigel's strong arms room. Okay, plan A is to pickpocket the Pine Watch treasure key off her. Make sure you have some calm ready. This one right here, go for that one first. And the steel mace is draining, very interesting. Huh. Okay, let's go for the money. And finally, this, we got it all. Pine Watch key won't be applicable because it just opens the loot chest and we can't take any loot anyways. So we got everything. If you can't get anything, if you fail at everything, don't worry about it. You'll just have to use your lock picking potion. Okay, so it's major trap time. Rigel has set a ton of traps here and the Pine Watch treasure key is for this master lock door here. Treasure room key. That's what that's for. If you can't pickpocket that key, you'll have to pick that lock. Uh, yep. Watch out for traps. Ton of traps. So watch the floor carefully. Alternatively, you could. I can't show you because uh, I don't want to level up, but you could get the. Uh, I forget the name of the perk in the sneak skill tree. Lightfoot or something like that. I wouldn't recommend it though, because you don't really need it. And this is where it all happens. Watch out for the maze trap. And end in silver mode is right in there. Watch out for a trap right... This is diabolical. Yeah, really deadly. I actually fell for that in a practice run. Okay, so... And end in silver mode and a ton of loot here, but you can't take any of it because none of it's marked as steel. That's alright. And we are out of here. And this will take us back to the beginning. And you should really <laughs> do as I say, not as I do. Make sure you're using your detect light. One time, I don't know how we got back here, but somebody from the other section, whom I left alive, was in this tunnel. 
on the way back up. Totally took me by surprise. So yeah, something to watch out for. Okay, let's go back to Mark Hearth. Uh, hunker down. Just in case there's some animals outside, get some detect life happening, and out we go. Okay, usually I like to go around the side here. Up around the back, and if we can wait, that means we can fast travel, we can fast travel. Take us back, thanks to Mr. Map. There we go. Alright, shields down, Scotty. <laughs> Stop doing that, Slick. Here we go. Okay. Get on your business gear. There we go. Heard they're reforming the Dawn Guard. Vampire. Come on in. This is Markarth, Traveler. Safe and safe. A legend rules. we all know and love. Okay, ended so my man. Guess what? My wife Kira runs our jewelry stall in the market. Oh, that's your wife. Oh, okay, and I have your silver mold. Somebody's more than trying to backdoor me. You want to hustle it up here? Feet in our city and earned every bit of your reward. Tell Delvin that he can count on me to provide the influence around here with the right people when he needs it. If you're ever looking to sell any illegally obtained merchandise, I'd also provide my services as a fence. It's the least I can do. All right. So we have a new fence, leather boots of minor sneaking. Huh. Interesting. All right. And like I said, you should definitely try to pickpocket this guy of Kira's key. Yeah. Got it. Okay. Now that this is a city of influence, I've made a lot of new contacts thanks to you, and more contacts means more coin for everyone. Now we could go on a pickpocketing rampage here, um, but I'm gonna—I don't want to do that now because I'm gonna over level. So, let's cure his key for his lock. I'm gonna show you. Let's just wait till after hours. Insert diabolical laughter. <laughs> okay, everybody, bedtime. Off you go. Off you go, the Kira. Go have a glass of wine. Atta girl. Okay, now, Kira's key opens up this display case right here. And inside the display case is a silver necklace, a silver emerald necklace. Ha 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 ha. A silver jeweled necklace. Ha ha ha. Silver ring, silver granite ring, and another silver amethyst ring. Get me this little, little tricky. The necklaces are easy, it's the rings. Because you can't. So let's just use a Detect Life. He's best friend. Guy right there. Oh, <laughs> I ended. <laughs> I, I thought I dropped something beside your wife's market stand here. I was just looking for it. <laughs> Gotta take a chance. Uh oh. Uh oh. 15 bouncy. Okay, so this is the city of influence. Somebody can arrest me? Arrest me. Is that n not enough bounty? Stop. By order of there the guard. Stop okay. right there. Okay, listen. Just take the seven gold and I push can off. All your problems with the Done. Yeah. Now, move along. <laughs> before That's you what get I say. in trouble. Move along. One more. Got it. Okay, we're good. <laughs> and we are good. Hey, I'd like to thank you all very much for watching. See you next video. Hey guys, real walkthroughs like these are an endangered species here on YouTube. For a complete lowdown on the YouTube video game walkthrough scene, check out my Patreon page and please consider making a donation to yours truly, Major Slack, to help keep real walkthroughs alive on YouTube. You can donate as little as $1. That's $1. That's all. That's all it takes. All right. Thanks a lot. Really appreciate it.